So here we are. Found a wild dragon. <laughs> Looking at him. Look. Look at the flag. Look at him. Now I have. <laughs> Look at his face. Ooh, looking very um looking very debony. This is the ice tower. Shout! <laughs> scream, I am the Prince of Wales! Oh. Look at his face! Look at these stairs! Look at teeny weeny they are! We're coming up to you. Oh. I'm not the skinniest people, so this isn't cool. I found myself a dragon! Rawr! You didn't roar! Rawr! <laughs> <laughs> and then this is the flag? What flag is it? This is um, Roger Montgomery. Roger Montgomery's flag. Look how pretty it is. It's your colours. It is my colours. <laughs> and you would come here 600 years later <laughs> to claim what is mine. And that's the... what was it? That is the Declare flag. Which you said about earlier. Yeah, I'll put some stuff in the video for this as well. So Sorry. You know, well, everyone's aware of what's going and on. And then, there's another flag, which I don't know. From here it looks like the Wales flag, I don't think it is. That's the Wales flag over there. Uh, yeah, that's the British With flag the next to it. Union Jack. We'll, we'll go and explore the Um, My thumb going away then, I apologise. That massive fuck off tower right there is where the dungeons are kept. Well, underneath there is. We got some barrels there. It's a random woman. Um, The massive... What was it? Map? Can't think of the word map. I was like the grease flag up there. Do 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 Grease lightning go, grease lightning. And then we got some more people. And then stuff and I don't want to drop my phone off. That's how high we are. Yeah, so you guys got a little sign. And there's a coffee! Yes. Alright. <laughs> that, was, that was so sudden. <laughs> Oh, there we have a church! <laughs> In the distance over there, and it's very foggy and misty here as well. Oh, misty eye the hillside below. Is there anything you want to say? What? Is there anything you want to say? Not really. <laughs> well, I've been Panda, he's been Dragon. Bye bye, everyone. Bye bye. Bye. Okay, so um, this is a bit awkward, but basically. Uh, my audio messed up for most of my recordings on my phone. That previous recording was on Panda's phone, fortunately. So um, it wasn't until we had the sort of return of the journey where um, I was able to fix this with my phone. So the next kind of few clips and photos will just be me talking over it. So this is a map of Wales and just the surrounding area of the castle. This is We're actually on top of the tower here, which is one of the highest points of the castle. So I'm just giving you a little bit of a tour with the camera right now, just going around, showing you some of the work has gone into building this castle, some of the stuff uh, which you can see down below as well. Okay, so this next part is inside one of the rooms of the castle and it shows you a little clip of Roger Montgomery as Panda does some dancing in the background right there. Uh, just a few things on the screen that comes up. It shows you Wales, shows you a little bit about the history of Roger Montgomery. I definitely would recommend checking him out uh, online. Type his name in, check a little bit out. He's quite an interesting uh, character in Welsh history, especially in West Wales. Um, and it shows you some of the arrows, some of the conquests that went on back then as well, from France into southern England there as well. Okay, so this is the final part now where I do a voiceover. I wanted to keep this in because it's really important. So basically I'm showing you on the screen now how narrow the steps are when you make a climb all the way to the top of one of the towers. Now the tower we are actually going to is the Declare Tower here. This is named after Gilbert Declare, who was a very powerful warrior and baron of his time. He actually had the nickname Strongbow and he was the Earl of Pembroke in 1138. Now as you can see the stairs are very very narrow indeed. It took me a while to sort of climb these and believe me I was out of breath climbing all of these uh, towers but here we are you can see by the light now at the top we have just about made it to the top of the Declare Tower uh, as you can see wasn't a very good day either very very windy very wet stuff as well just give you a little panel uh, sorry sorry panorama view I guess and there's the flag the Declare flag at the top of the tower there as we circle around now the top of the tower and this panda hugging a wall as well Hello everyone, my name is Dragonheart the Prince of Wales and I am here in Swansea, Swansea train station. Here is Panda and here are some bikes. 
So we are on the return leg of our trip now. We've just been on a two hour train journey and we are now going to be on another hour train journey and then we're going to be swapping over again and another no, no, hour train, <laughs> another hour train journey. So all together it's about, well, over four hours on a train, um, which is really annoying because it takes up most of the day or you know, the main part of the day anyway. Um, but we had a good time in Pembroke yesterday. We had a look at some of the stuff that was there. Nice to read about some of the famous kings and stuff. Obviously, it being the place of uh, King Henry the Seventh birthplace. Birthday. Birthday. I, I, I Birthday. talk like a lisp that time. So yeah, that was pretty cool. I'm not used to recording on my phone either, so um, I keep looking like my eyes go doing that all the time. But I'm supposed to be looking here, which is rather weird. And hopefully, this comes out well as well because otherwise it's going to be weird isn't it darling? It is. Of course, of course. Uh, so yeah, this is the train station, just give you a little tour of what Swansea, Swansea train station looks like. We don't usually go on this one, we usually end up going on the Cardiff train station lines where we usually go. So this is all new to me. Well, if I drive down here normally, this takes 50 minutes. The fact that we have a two hour journey now by train is it's really awful. Yeah, there's a train right, well, there's a train just left right now, but if we'd gone on that one, we'd end up paying, what was it, £30? £30 we'd have been paying £30 more than what we paid, so we've got to wait half an hour now for the train, but at least that's a bit cheaper than what we would have done in... Well, 20 minutes now. About 20 minutes now, because I'm taking, up, taking up your precious time making this video right now. Your face is so close to the camera. I know, my face is like so close to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be so annoying, Panda. You're scaring the viewers away. This is, why, this, is, this is where Dragon's Heart Channels goes down the drain, basically. Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Um, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> She's being mean to me. So, yeah, I'm going to end the video here. I've been Dragon Heart the Prince of Wales. She's been a panda. It's windy. <laughs> Until next time, goodbye. <laughs>